Welcome to today's episode. Let's talk about today's guest. We are Diksha from WildNet Technologies. How are you doing today? Hi, I'm doing great. How about you? I'm doing great. Thank you so much for asking. And well, uh, I'm excited to learn a little bit more about WildNet Technologies. So, so let's kick it off with that. In, in your own words, can you tell us a little bit more? Sure. So uh, WildNet Technologies is a digital agency. We have different departments. We work more majorly in PPC, paid ads, in paid social, paid search. Apart from that, we have other departments which deal into uh, development, website development, app development, et cetera, as well as SEO. So we have different departments and we are majorly whitelisting agency. We help other agencies located in US, UK, Canada, across the globe to provide them resources, uh, skillful resources. So that's what we do. Perfect. Awesome. And is there a certain vertical segment? Is there an ideal ICP for you guys that you guys like to go for? We are, uh, we do great job in PPC, paid search and paid social ads. Okay. But is there a vertical that you guys like to work with a, a certain type of client? So we generally work with agencies, no matter that agency is into which segment, but agencies are our main clients, mid-scale agencies and the large-scale agencies. Okay. And so how would these agencies usually find out about you guys? Is there a top client acquisition for you? Uh, yeah, so we have system plays there. We have inbound system and the outbound system as well. We have been into industry since 2010. So we have strong networking. We go to their uh, to their headquarters and located U in US and UK uh, to meet them, to uh, make some great bonds with them. And that's how we get good leads. Apart from that, we have a proper cold outreach system set up for email marketing with LinkedIn outreach, et cetera. So that's how we get majority of our leads. Apart from that, our website is also very mature. We have made, as we have one separate development uh, department, we have great website. Okay, perfect, awesome. And, and so that way our listeners can go ahead and visit you guys. They can visit you at wildnettechnologies.com. What role does the website play for client acquisition? Website always in 21st century, website is very important. It plays a major role. Uh, on our website, there's a complete information. It, it act as a complete salesperson and have all the knowledge and uh, requirement which is required to acquire any client. So it plays very major role. It reduces our salesperson's job too much. So. Okay, perfect, awesome. And is there any tools or tips or methods that you would recommend to our listeners as far as some website lead generation? I think uh, for website lead generation, it is very important to have very clean website with all the information segmented into a uh, small boxes or i may i might say small sections very cleanly i think that's very important definitely i, I would i would agree with that and well and, and how about yourself dishka is there what, what would you say are you some of your your day-to-day -day tasks that you like that, that you do there at, at the company so i'm a passionate marketer so though i'm a senior uh, manager my main job is to manage my team of 10 to 15 people but then um, I love to delve into the accounts. We generally have accounts ranging from $3,000, $5,000 per month to $1 million per month. So I just help my team to analyze, to strategize uh, these accounts and ensure that we get the most performance out of it. Apart from that, I uh, ensure that our team is bonded enough. So we are located remotely. Uh, so everyone has support of other person uh, in the team. So this is my day to day job look like. And I read a lot. I read a lot of newsletters, etc. So I always make self, make myself updated. What, what is the last book that, that you read? Uh, I'm not more of a book fan. Uh, but yes, recently I have started reading $100 by Alex Hermonzi because it talks about customizing the offer, making the offer. It's very important for a marketer. I recommend to all the marketer and all my team members, um, but I'm more of a newsletter reading person. Perfect, awesome. And next is, uh, if there would be no boundaries in technology, Diksha, what would be that one thing that you want to have fixed for your role as a marketer today? That's a very interesting question. Okay, for I think if there's no uh, there's no restriction in the technology. Uh, if we can get a small chip, which we, we can put it in our brain and, you know, get all the updates every day, we don't have to research a lot for digital marketing techniques, new tools like yours. Like uh, there was a time when Hyros came, Triple Whales came and Pathmong can be one of them. So people don't have to search. It already comes into their mind 
I wish we have such technology. So yeah, maybe a small that, step for our brain to stay updated. That would be great. I, I'm sure one, one, one moment that it would be nice, but uh, we'll, 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 we'll wait. <laughs> yeah, the, the, Elon Max is already launching it. Soon it will be available maybe to all of us. <laughs> that, man. All right, awesome. Uh, next is if, if there's one repetitive task that you could automate, what would that be? Uh, I think I would love to automate the research system. Like sometimes research is very extensive, though we have tools and a lot of things available, but still manual or human research is mandatory. If we get better automated system where all the researches and everything comes in a one single uh, file, it will be great. Definitely. Okay, perfect. And lastly, uh, Diksha, as far as, 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 as it goes for you, right? I mean, you have a lot of experience already with, within the marketing world. But what is one piece of advice that you would give yourself if you were to restart your journey as a marketer today? Uh, I think, see, I was a passionate marketer since childhood. When I used to go to the uh, supermarts, I used to see where which product is uh, placed and why it is placed. So my brain worked as a marketer since childhood. But I wish I would have started my professional journey a little sooner. So that's all I think I, I wish if I, I was a marketer. Okay, perfect. Great, great, great advice there. Um, and we'll, uh, Diksha, we're, we are coming to the end of the show here. But before we end, I do want to give you the last word. If, if, if our listeners forget everything about the interview today, what is that one thing they should remember about your company? They should remember that our performances are the best performances. If anybody hires Violet, we provide best service. And it's been already 15, 20 years in the business, and we have never got a dissatisfied client. Uh, well, there you guys heard it. Uh, great, great, great work company working there. Uh, Diksha, thank you so much for being on. To our listeners, thank you so much for tuning in. And I'm looking forward to our next episode at Pathmonk Presents. Thanks a lot, Diksha. Thank you so much.